Today is May the 25th, 2023. This is Carmen bringing you your daily Bloodborne Remaster update. There's no news on a Bloodborne Remaster today, but some articles have been coming out about yesterday's very, very bad showcase. Uh, including one from Tom Henderson. If you don't know, Tom Henderson is a very, very, very reputable insider. Uh, he and Jeff Grubb are two of the, you know, most reputable, but like, whenever Tom Henderson says something, you know what's happening. Uh, so he said that a lot of the games that we were expecting to see at yesterday's showcase are actually, in his words, um, are like, what did he say? Like, almost finished, or basically done, whatever. Uh, and could have been shown, but they weren't. Now, I don't think what he's saying is, oh, they're ready to ship. I don't think that's what he's saying. Uh, I think what he's saying is, like, they are very far in development, well past the halfway point, could have been shown, weren't. And then this art, then this article uh, made people start speculating about this. And I'm not saying I believe this little theory, but I th it's not implausible. So, if you don't know, over the last, like, year, Sony has been trying their hardest to seem like the weak little... <laughs> the weak little person who couldn't stand it if Xbox acquired Activision Blizzard. And a lot of people are starting to think that. What if this showcase is a part of that? Like, what if they were trying to seem weak here, let Microsoft blow the doors off everything uh, in their showcase in a couple weeks, and then later drop the real showcase? Now, this, I think, is actually... Um, Pretty likely. I'm not going to lie. Sony has been trying their hardest to seem like the weak little, the weak person who can't compete for the last year to get this showcase blocked. I mean, to get this acquisition blocked. So I think the idea that they were really, really trying to, trying to seem feeble in this one makes a lot of sense to me. Not saying it's true, but I'm saying it makes a lot of sense why so many games weren't there. So uh, I could see it. I could see them doing like a showcase around September and really blowing the doors off everything. We'll have to see. Only time will tell. But I I believe this theory. I think it's very close to the mic. I believe it's very, very likely, to be honest with you. The, this would not be the first time something like this has happened, I bet. And it, like I said, it makes a lot of sense, man, I'm telling you. When you really start to think about it. But, uh, yeah. Moral of the story, though, is yesterday's showcase was trash, and it may have been intentionally so. So, yeah. There's no news on a Bloodborne remaster, of course. However, I will also maybe be live on Monday with Elden Ring. Uh, depends on how things shake out, but I should be. Anyways, no news on a Bloodborne remaster today. That's been your daily Bloodborne remaster update for May the 25th, 2023.